Just a quick video today talking about the difference between Cherry MX Red switches and Silence. So the Corsair Strafe RGB here has Cherry MX Silent. This is a Corsair K70 Lux. It has Cherry MX Reds. And this is a Corsair K63, also with Cherry MX Reds. The reason I'm using Corsair keyboards though is because they seem to have altered their sound. These new keyboards, for some reason, are much louder than the old ones. Say the Corsair K95 RGB, which is my main keyboard. That one actually sounds really good. It's quiet. It's fairly smooth, and with O-rings, I absolutely love typing on it. So I hope this video can encourage Corsair to go back to what they were doing, because I think the loudness is actually not a good thing. If you want a loud keyboard, just get Cherry MX Blues. So I'll try to show you what I'm talking about. This is the MX Silence. No O-rings on those, they are just quiet. But that's an older generation keyboard of Corsair. This is a K70 Lux, and this is a new gen, and quite loud. So it just has a high pitch sort of sound to it. And lastly, the K63. So despite being a plastic finish, it's still really, really loud compared to the older strafe there. Okay, now I'm going to go rapidly between them so you can actually hear the difference. So the Cherry MX Silence on the older generation board seem to be really quiet, and the K63 and K70, they're actually quite loud. The difference, I think, or from what I can hear in this room, is that the K63 has a deeper sort of tone to it, versus the K70. The next question is, what do they sound like with O-rings? So this is a K70 Lux. The left arrow on each keyboard is the one with the O-ring. So that's with the O-ring, without. So I wouldn't say there's too much difference there. And when I was using these keyboards, I didn't really bother putting O-rings on them because you need double just to make a difference. Now the same test with the silence. Again, there's not much difference there. And now same test on the K63. Again, O-rings under this one. So I'd say there's definitely a difference there. Putting O-rings on the K63 is worth it, if you're going for a quieter board. So just to give you a better comparison, microphone is now between the two. Cherry MX Silent with the O-ring, Cherry MX Red with the O-ring. So to conclude this, I would say that the K17 Lux and also the K65, they're very loud even with Cherry MX Reds, even with O-rings. So there's not much you can do about that. The K63, it's quite loud without O-rings, but with them and Cherry MX Reds, you can get a fairly dampened sound. But the undisputed king is the Strafe RGB with Cherry MX Silence. O-rings or not. It's just a really quiet keyboard, and definitely one of my favorites still. I'm just going to finish this off with typing tests on each keyboard for you. K70 Lux with Cherry MX Red. K63 with Cherry MX Red.
Strife RGB with Cherry Omeg Silence. Really quiet, no key chatter or whatever you call it. Sounds great, love this keyboard. I just wish they'd make a smaller version and more compact. I don't think we need these massive bars up here. And if we had a 10 keyless, that would be even better. Still, if you're after a keyboard that's really quiet for streaming or just late night playing, I highly recommend this one.